Today is not only Veterans Day, but also Route 66's birthday. The mother road turned 98 today. And Claremore decided to celebrate in a lasting way. That's where 2 News Oklahoma Samson Tamajani was this afternoon. November 11th is not only Veterans Day, November 11th is the birthday of the Mother Road. It's just the second of its kind in Oklahoma, the first in the northeast part of the state. And as these men will tell you, it nods to the past while looking forward to the next two years, specifically in Claremore. Well, it's really special to us, one, because of the significance of Claremore and Route 66. But Oklahoma has more miles of Route 66 than any other state in the country, and Rogers County, which Claremore is the county seat, has more miles than any other county. So when you're the home to Will Rogers, when you're home to the J.M. Davis Gun Museum, when you're home in Rogers County to the Blue Whale down in Catoosa, there are a lot of significant aspects. Case in point, Will Rogers' great-granddaughter Jennifer made sure to witness Monday's unveiling just after moving back from California. And as you are well aware, in 1952, Route 66 was rededicated as the Will Rogers Memorial highway. So we're really excited for all this happening in Claremore. The Oklahoma Route 66 Centennial Commission actually made it a point to hire a local artist for this marker, also paying homage to Claremore's history as a military convoy stop. These are going to be spread out across the country from Chicago to the coast, the west coast, as we progress forward with this. So we're super excited. It probably helps that this is not designed by AI. Yeah, isn't that amazing? There's still and an things. Oklahoma artist. And it's an Oklahoma artist, American made. You know, we can still have those things, right? <laughs> In Claremore, Samson Tamajani, 2 News, Oklahoma.